and welcome back to my channel, Happy Artist. As my subscribers are growing, I'm doing my utmost to thank those who have supported me from the very beginning. Some of you have made requests on previous videos and I'm doing my utmost to fulfill those requests. This video is for probably my youngest supporter. From what I hear, she knows when my videos come out and the first thing she wants to do on Saturday morning is watch these videos of mine. Thank you so, so much. Just for you, I'm going to paint a beautiful flower. And I hear that you like the colors pinks and purples. I've tried this in quite a few attempts. My first vision was a cherry blossom tree because I absolutely am fascinated by them. I think they're absolutely beautiful. But I'm going to need to try that on another attempt because I did it on a piece of cardboard as a tester and it did not go very well using a balloon. I just had paint everywhere. <laughs> so I'm going to try that again. Here are a few attempts, all failed attempts, at trying to get the balloon technique to work. Clearly I'm going to need to do a little bit more research because the paint landed up looking more beautiful on the balloon than it did on my canvas. I tried thinning down the paint, I tried using thicker paint, I tried not putting too much pressure on the balloon, I tried putting so much pressure on the balloon that it was probably going to slip off the canvas. The videos that I've watched so far make it look so easy, but it's not a very easy technique. I gave up on the balloons for now then, and I'd also seen a few videos using cellophane or cling wrap, which let's be honest, none of us know why it's called cling wrap because it never clings to anything you wanted to cling on. When using the cling wrap, try and make sure that you pick it up from all four corners and you pick it up in an even form. If you pick it up just from one side, I learned that you land up moving the paint off to that same side and you just basically make a swipe rather than it picking up in a circular motion. If you are not yet aware, I'm running a giveaway for the month of October coming up soon. Have a quick look at my Facebook page for all the details. I was so incredibly happy with what happened in this middle flower, but I thought, how on earth am I going to finalize this painting now? Because I was so happy with that one. So I tried it again, and that's where I learned that you cannot pick up the cellophane or cling wrap from one side to the other. Now that I've finally got that technique down properly, I tried on a completely new and clean canvas because I was very frustrated when I didn't get this technique right on probably six tries. I know there are other artists out there who feel that pain. I hope that you enjoy the flowers that I've painted for you. Have a wonderful day. Ciao for now. Hi, I'm Tash. No glasses in this video. No. She knows that my video, she knows. I'm going to need to do it clearly, clearly. Picking up in a central, in a, mm. now that I've finally got all those techniques done. Properary. I hope that you've enjoyed the painting that I've done. Not painting. I hope that you enjoy the painting. No, my gosh. Few attempts. My first visage, visage, 